Welcome back to another My Hero Academia review. Today is season three, episode three, and or episode forty-one total. <laughs> I'm Justin. What is up? I'm Logan. And together we're Couch Talk. As always, we are anime viewers only. No source material. We're gonna discuss the episode and give our scores at the end. You ready? I am ready. So, like we were saying last episode, they're gonna have to bring in Class B. Hey. Uh, which they did bring them in, and a lot of the first half of steps is pretty straightforward. It's just them, you know, developing their quirks, which they do that by repeatedly using them and just going past their limits. Right. It's like any strength training. You just break it down. Break it down. It. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> we do get the full wild, wild pussy cats gang. Stop laughing, Logan. It's inappropriate. <laughs> No, they're just a funny group with their very... (laughs) They are a funny group. I like them. (laughs) They brought... Like, Tiger, he's hilarious. (laughs) Uh, And they're there just to help give them the training they need. Because they are the best at getting people to do it done quickly. Uh, I like how Deku's training is just... Looks the most simplest out of everyone. He's just like... <laughs> it looks like it's he's like... stretching. <laughs> <laughs> well, every once in a while... He's like I guess he's he doing to... the Superman in place or something. Right. Every once in a while he has to try and punch a yeah, tiger. Yeah. It doesn't work. He bends. He's like, I thought weird. it was plus ultra. <laughs> <laughs> That's basically how this one goes. Um, of course, they have to make their own food now. They ain't gonna be helped. I'm gonna say that's gotta be the worst part. When you're hungry and you have to make yourself food, it's miserable. <laughs> and you're exhausted, like, they're just way more exhausted than anyone else would be. Like, right, like... They're like, oh, those those powers you've been using for the last, like, 12 hours straight? Use them again to light <laughs> these furnaces so we can cook our damn food. That um, would be awful. I also feel bad for the... The ones that have to take the extra classes. Oh, yeah. The ones that failed the <laughs> They were done exam. at like 2 a.m. and they had to get up at 7. And it's like, woo! <laughs> that like, would be... Should have got better, okay? <laughs> like, uh, I do also like... Um, hold on, uh, let me... Sarah was like talking with Momo and he's like, Oh, so your power's like poop, <laughs> That's one way to put it. <laughs> Eat a lot of food and stuff comes out, I guess. <laughs> uh, then we get a little more from Koda as uh, <clears throat> Deku follows him to his hideout. Right. Come on, man. You don't follow a person to a secret hideout. It's no longer a secret hideout. That's how you could have stopped that, man. All one villain had to do was follow him home one day. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, but we find he's just, he hates anybody with, like, a quirk, period, really. He just hates the whole quirk system. Uh, it's kind of understanding, like, really, yeah. they're all just kind of show off, and it leads off to all these things. And it's like, yeah, it kind of does feel can, that way. Yeah, like, I can see his side. Like, he feel like everything would be simpler with no quirks. But also, that's just... I mean, you still have the same problem, so... Right, you'll still have... Well, at least with quirks, <clears throat> you have... I don't know. I don't. I don't think with quirks it makes it any better. It's just, hey, you yourself are better and cooler. Yeah. I mean, but, uh, it's just something he has. I mean, it's just how it is, man. <laughs> with or without quirks, your parents probably would have been killed, died, something at some point. It's sad. Right. And I. But think I'm just he... say throughout the. What? Sorry, I think he has a quirk, because it panned to like a big indention in the rock. As if, like, he punched yeah, it or something. Yeah, it so is I'm true. Assuming he has, like, a strength quirk, kind of like Deku. <clears throat> Probably. I also want to say, that whole scene, I was just staring at the curry, because I don't know if he brought him any type of utensils to eat it with. I was like, is there a fork, a spoon, some chopsticks? I don't see any of those. That's why he's so mad. <laughs> I was like, oh, you brought curry, that's nice. You gonna make him fucking eat it with his hand? <laughs> like, what the hell, dude? You're supposed to be a nice guy. Here you are. You just like eat it with your hands, you damn peasant. <laughs> it's like, whoa. Enjoy Thank this you. curry. 
was like what with the no heck utensils. <laughs> um. Then we just get a lot more uh, training after that. He goes, talks with the uh, Todoroki about it a little bit too. About hey, um, how should I talk to Koda about someone? <laughs> It was like he tried giving his own like pass to him. <laughs> obviously that didn't work. Uh, right, Todoroki's like obviously a completely different situation of it too. Todoroki's like, like you're really like, good at intervening with someone's personal shit. <laughs> <laughs> he, he is. It's, he just wants everyone to be happy. Yeah, he's just trying to be. He has good good intentions. <clears throat> but finally, and of course. None of the other teachers were coming because none of them been told. So that kind of gives a hint, like, maybe All Might's not going to be there later. Right, he's not going to be the one to bail them out or right. anything like this. So I mean, if he's to not told, himself. I don't even think he can get there. And, well, maybe, but I don't know how he'd hear about it. <laughs> yeah, that is true. <laughs> so there is something to keep in mind, because we do have the villains in this episode. They're gonna, they do attack in this episode, too. But the point is that they might have to actually do this themselves. Right. And they don't have, and we know, uh, Ice was obviously strong, but we know he's not good at group fights. Yeah. Because exactly. there's way too much going on. And there were seven to start, and they're waiting. They said they were going to wait for their final three, so, uh, and they did attack, so I'm guessing that means all ten are there. That's yeah. quite a bit of villains, and they're not weak villains at all. Yeah, the, the Vanguard squad or yeah, something. Yeah, the Vanguard Dude. squad. They, they ruined the little weird haunted mansion haunted forest training courage <laughs> to <stuff>. scare each <laughs> other <laughs> dude the music that plays with the villains is spooky and then later on it's like some hardcore metal stuff. i just want to say their union came through they won they no longer had to wait till after the credits they got before <laughs> the credits to attack okay the villain union is coming out on top okay <laughs> <laughs> they use their poisoning to knock out some guys. They blighting the forest on fire. Uh, Pixie Bob just got yanked. Right. So there's yeah, there's what's his name Dobby. Dobby, Dobby. uses fire. So yeah, you got Toga. Toga's Ooh. just a crazy ass. <laughs> like she's just. <laughs> and then you got like that mummy guy. Yeah, who or was like he's in, in like a straight jacket thing. <laughs> Yeah, he's that's, spooky. Yeah, that's better. He's just—he's clearly psychotic because he is in a straight jacket. That's you have the lizard stain, <laughs> who like dresses just like stain. He's—he's he's like the guy in battle, right? Croak. Oh yeah, croak. <laughs> you have the guy with just a giant rock thing, rock which killing? he used to pound Pixie Bob. <laughs> Stop, Logan. <laughs> you need to work on your phrasing. And then we have, is that all of them? Well, I don't think we named all ten, but... Well, the we ones did, that we we've get, seen. We got glimpses of some. Like, uh, Rip Kota. Yeah, Kota. Kota I'm pretty sure that's going to be... hovering him. That's going to be either the eighth, ninth, or tenth one, the one we haven't seen yet, would be my guess. Wow, well, get the eighth, ninth, or tenth. Yeah, that's, I'm saying, like, we, had, we <laughs> saw original, seven, original. <laughs> and yeah. then it's either going to be... Okay, it's going to be the eighth one. Does that make <laughs> uh, Yeah, so... It's about to go down. Yeah, it is about to go down. And, boy, next episode's going to be so exciting. I'm excited already. Uh, a lot of people are already... Spread. See, now it's kind of like... I'm wondering how they're going to do this, because they got Class B involved as well. That's going to be a lot of characters they're going to have to try to integrate in some way. I, they're probably just going to be like, all right, the poison's going to knock out a whole, half of them, okay? <laughs> and then, then we don't have to worry about showing all these other characters. That's most likely what's going to happen. I hope we do get some team fights with, like... Yeah, exactly. I'm just hoping they do it as well as they were when they are trying to get to their training. Right. Okay, whereas <clears throat> we just got a nice little bus ride over. Uh <laughs> Oh, I'm so hyped for next episode. But, I mean, that's... That's it. That is mostly it. Fairly straightforward episode, so... Um... Jumping scores now? Sure. I'll go you, for it. Okay. I'm gonna give it... Uh, seven and a half, I think. Uh... 
I feel like that. Yeah, that's solid. Um, okay. <laughs> it sounds Stop like it. you're conflicting yeah, with yeah, yourself. No. <laughs> you're having like I'm always conflicting, man. Like, I watch it, I'm like, oh, this is a score. And then, you know, later I start to, like, think on it. And it's like, no, this is what I should have given it. Okay. And then it's like, too late at that point. But here it is. I'll give it a seven and a half. Like, again, a lot of it is just kind of straightforward. Uh, but we. I'm just, they do a really good job of getting the villains involved here at the end, just getting them to attack. I like it when they're just like, they think the police, uh, the police, the, they think the peace belongs to them, but it actually belongs to us. So they're like, we control their peace. And it's like, damn, dude, that's pretty I mean, villain. That is, <laughs> like, a, that is true. <laughs> like, and they're just ready to mess everything up. So that's exciting. Um, again, just, where are their food utensils there in the curry, man? It's bothering me. <laughs> but, uh, you know, I'm just glad to see them all come together, and I'm hoping they do a really good job in the next episode with all the fighting and just integrating all the characters. <clears throat> yeah, I'll give it... I'll give it an 8. It was essentially a training montage, but I just like the uniqueness of it. Like, we yeah. already know everyone's quirk, but they found a unique way to, like, train them. So yeah, that was, so that was what cool. needs to be done. Right. That was cool. The pussycats are hilarious. <laughs> um, <clears throat> It's just, this felt like the build-up setup for the villains. Because the yeah. villains look like they're not messing around. Ten villains yeah, at once. They... Yeah, and they waited for them to be more exhausted. Right, it's the middle of the night after their long-ass <laughs> training day. <clears throat> I'm just super excited. Like, these are like legit villains. These aren't the little minion villains that attacked UA. These are like yeah, exactly. These have these villains have names. That's how you know they're for real. <laughs> but it's true. All of them did have names here. <laughs> But yeah, some it's were just... more pointed out than others. Though, like obviously, Davi and Toga are the probably the main. They're two. like the leaders. Dobby more so, I'd say. I feel like <clears throat> eight, nine, and ten are going to be like a tier above all the others, though, and that's why they're late. We're we're strong, so we can get to be late. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That, that's a very villain mindset. It's also <laughs> like you know, the hero shows up at the last moment. Because they're strong, they don't have to come in right away because it ruins everything, <laughs> right? So, it works both ways. Right. I'm just super excited. Like, uh, next episode's going to be amazing. Yeah, they're going to... This is where Koda's going to... going to have to bring him in there with Deku. I, I'm i assuming Deku be like... is going to save him or try to well, save him? Well, he was the one that said Koda at the end. And right. Then to him, so... <clears throat> It's it's going down. I'm We're excited to see all ten. Parents. Continue, yes, <laughs> all ten, yes. I am also excited. Uh, I think that does it for our review, though. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's a good dark turn. <laughs> but give us the speed. Give us the speed. As always, if you want to stop the villain union, be sure to like, subscribe, comment down below, let us know what you thought of the episode, what you did, didn't like, what you would score it. Also hit the notification bell to be notified every time we upload. We uh, stream over on twitch.tv, links are in the description below, and until next time, peace out. See ya.